Hey, what is up everybody? Welcome back to my channel. For those of you that don't know me, my name is Josh Collier and I'm an aspiring New Zealand bodybuilder. In today's video, I'm just gonna do a bit of an update on how I'm tracking, how my training is going, how my diet is going and all that. And also do a bit of a workout montage for my shoulders and arm workout today. So let's get into the physique update. So today I weighed in at 87.9 kgs, which is down about 900 grams from last week, almost a kg, which I'm pretty happy with that. That's the aim, to lose about a kg a week. I'm stoked with that. I'm happy with how I'm looking in the physique update we just saw. And yeah, I'm very happy with how I'm tracking. Training is going very good at the moment. I'm just trying to progress as much as I can, even though I'm still cutting. Just trying to up the weight each week and with good form. And if I need to stick with the same weight, for another session, I'll do that in perfect the form. Diet's going very good, it's on lock. I'm very strict and just following the plan, which is very good. I'm also still doing 15 minutes post-workout cardio on the treadmill, list cardio, which is low intensity severe state for those that you don't know what list cardio is. It's going all pretty good, but something I do want to talk about is like cheating on your diet and everything like that. Controlling your mind and controlling your emotions and not letting them get too high. For example, after a long day of work, when I work and I know shifts, I'll come home from work and just want to eat a lot of things. So you have to take a step back and realize that your emotions are high and just take a step back and follow the plan and think about the consequences if you do cheat on your diet and just stick to the plan and trust the process. And that leads me on to my next point, which is basically a lot of people look up every couple of days just looking for the progress and not seeing any results and get discouraged but you've got to trust the process and if you truly trust the process you're going to stick to the plan day in and day out and not look up every couple of days looking for the results and just put your head down go to work and over time you're going to see results for example if you gain a kg over a day people usually freak out and cut the calories but if you just trust the process stick to your plan and keep going it's over the week that you see the progress not the day Fluctuations happen with how much water you drink, how much you train, how hard you train, the amount of cardio you do, how much you eat. It all depends on that, and looking at the week to week scale is gonna show you progress no matter what. I've lost 900 grams this week, and I've lost over about three kgs in the last like two and a half weeks. So we're tracking very well, and it's the progress over the long term that matters, and not the day to day fluctuations and the weight gain, the weight loss, whatever. Just look at it in the long term, and if you truly trust the process, you'll be in it for the long haul and the long game, and you'll be able to trust the process and see the results over time. I'm pretty happy with how everything's tracking. I'm dialed in right now. I'm so motivated and determined to get to my best shape in my life. I'm hoping to cut it for another month, maybe. I'm not quite sure in the four weeks. We'll see. See how the progress goes, but I want to get down to a good body fat percentage before I do go into a lean bulk and try and put on some size and some mass. That's a bit of an update how I'm feeling. I'm feeling really good, not too tired at the moment. Calories aren't too low. They're around 2,400 to 2,500 a day. That's basically it for the update. I was loving the split we're doing so far. Push, pull, legs, rest, chest and back, shoulders and arms and legs, rest and then repeat. Do a workout montage for the shoulders and arms. And yeah, it's gonna be a good session. So cue the workout montage.
turn it up. Turn it on.